Hello everyone, I'm Coco Sherelle and welcome to my channel Bling and Air. Today I have a pair of high top all white monochrome converses that I will be decorating in white diamond crystals and gold half pearls. These will be designed for a quinceanera. So if you would like to see how I get these done, please keep watching. If this is your first time to my channel, thank you for clicking on this video. Hopefully you like what you see. Hit the thumbs up and subscribe button to be part of the Bling family. For my returning viewers and Bling family, it's always a pleasure to have you tune in. Now y'all don't forget to give this video a thumbs up because you already know it's going to be another beauty. Right here I'm doing my usual prep work. I'm going to file it down and then I'm going to use 100% pure acetone to clean it up. This is my second favorite glue next to Loctite. This is Liquid Fusion, and I swear by this glue, I love it more than E6000 because it does not have any harsh, toxic fumes. So yes, this is my go-to glue for Converse's. Two hours later and I have completed the areas where I wanted the white diamond crystals. If you would like to see a tutorial on how I got that done, there will be a video link in my description section below. But I'm moving full speed ahead and here are the half gold pearls. And I love these because they're in like a matte satin finish. I love it. Please go check out my Amazon storefront for all the items that I used today. That link will be in my description section below. Okay, these are nice and stuffed and ready to decorate. I'm just gonna add a little bit more plastic in certain areas. I wanna make sure I get all those creases out so it'll be good to adhere the pearls too. We don't want no lumps and no bumps. Now it's time to paint these converses in a metallic gold fabric paint. Yep, I said it, paint. If you know me by now, you know I love to paint my converses and the color of the rhinestones or the pearls that I'm using. I'm going really light with the paint, just applying a thin layer because pearls will be on top of this. The paint job does not have to be perfect at all. Okay, here we go with the liquid fusion and we're gonna add the pearls now to the body of the sneakers.
So the design of the sneaker will be in a scattered pattern. I'm gonna use different size pearls to create this pattern. But along the edges of the sneaker, I'm only gonna be using three millimeter. Doing the body of a converse can take me maybe three to four hours to complete. It just depends on the size pearls that I'm using. And a lot of times when I'm working, I'll watch something on Netflix, listen to inspirational music, or watch YouTube. <laughs> so for the duration of this video, it's gonna be sped up. Please enjoy what I love doing best. And thank you guys so much for watching. Hey everyone, we are at the final stretch. Just a couple more pearls to go in this section. I cannot wait for you guys to see the finished look. I love, I love, I love these. Don't they just scream royalty? Oh, that gold is just striking. These are fit for a quinceanera. I finished these off with the matte gold satin ribbon lace that looks so pretty with it and my little signature rhinestone buckle in the middle like I normally do. Don't forget guys, all the items will be in the description section in my Amazon storefront for you guys to check it out, okay? I wanted to take this moment to express my deepest gratitude for your support to my channel. Whether you've been here from the beginning or just stumbled upon my content recently, your viewership comments and feedback means the world to me. Thanks to your support, I'm able to continue creating and sharing the content that I'm passionate about. It is truly humbling to see the numbers of subscribers grow and the positive impact my videos have had on others. I promise to continue working hard to bring you engaging, informative, and creative content that you guys enjoy. Your feedback and suggestions are always welcome, so please don't hesitate to share your thoughts with me in the comments section. Once again, thank you for watching, subscribing, and supporting my channel. It means more than you know. And until next time, stay safe and well. Bye.